Hello and welcome to Jira Lab. If you need to create a lot of tasks in Jira, typing it directly one by one will cost you a lot of time and effort. In this lab, I will show you the basics of importing tasks to Jira from Excel CSV file. I will start by preparing an Excel file. This needs to be properly formatted for importing data into Jira. There are a couple of things important to notice. Issue types that I'm going to import depend on the project configuration where you want to import tasks. For example, if you have a task type documentation and you do not have this task type configured in Jira, you will not be able to import these tasks. Please have a look at my project setting configuration. So here, if I go to project settings, as you can see, there are two issue types in my DMP project. It is Epic and Task. And in my Excel file, in column issue type, I also have only these two issue types, Epic and Task. Just like the column name issue type, other columns also correspond to field names in Jira. Epic names of Epics need to be exactly the same in the epic link column for tasks. Epic color is a kind of code that you need to assign, otherwise your epics will be all gray on the scrum board. Summary column is the title of your task. And now, without the priority column data, your priority field will be blank. But you need to check your configuration, what your priority names are. Let me show you where to look for it. So we go back to Jira. We go to administration. And in administration, we're looking for issues. Okay, we need to log in as administrator. And we go down and on the left hand side, there are priorities and here I will use the medium priority. All right, let's go back to Excel. So in Excel, my priority right now is medium and there are only a couple of other fields that we are going to import. The content of the assignee column and reported column depend on your user naming convention. So in my instance, my naming convention for username is three letters. And finally, the description field, which is optional. All right, now if you have your Excel file ready, the next step is to save the file in the CSV format and import it into Jira. Let's have a look how it's done. So I'll go to File, Save As, and I need to be sure which CSV format I'm choosing. So you need to select this CSV format, not the other two. All right. Do you want to keep using this format? Yes. After we have saved the file, we need to go to Jira now. Go to administration again, system. And on the left hand side, there will be external system import press the CSV tile and select the file that you have just saved. Okay. Press next. Here you need to select a project where you want your data to be imported. So in our case, it will be DMP marketing and press next. On this screen, you need to perform the field mapping. 
Sometimes there are errors in the CSV file and you can easily spot them when you press the map field value checkbox. I always use that option in my data migration to Jira. This is how it works. So SINE and I'm looking for SINE. Description, description. Now, when you are ready with the mapping, press the button next. On this screen, review the data, especially in the issue type section. Because if there are errors in your CSV file, they will be visible here. Also, if there is a problem with your priority field, it will be also visible here. All right, if you are done with your review, press the button begin import. All right. So if you plan on importing more data like this, you can save the configuration file. And this file can be used to skip the field mapping step next time you import the same type of data into the same project. Okay, so if you want to see the results of your work, it is best to go to issue search functionality and review the newly created issues. Using the basic search functionality, click more and select created date and choose the option within the last, let's say, five minutes. So you've just imported 31 new tasks into project DMP. So these are the results of your latest import. Okay, this is the end of this lab video. Thank you for visiting the Jira lab. Goodbye.